right guys I am running to the store the grocery store um, you guys know I love me my little grocery outlet oh hold on you guys can't see me let me turn is that better yeah I'm running to my uh, grocery outlet that's not too far from my house and I'm going to get uh, like the stuff for macaroni and cheese so um, not a big shopping haul um, getting a few things but um probably just uh want to grab the cheeses before they sell out of everything and they might already be because you know it's uh, right before thanksgiving so i might have to go to the regular store you guys um but i want to see what they got here because a lot of times i can get like my, my her body y'all excuse my hair i just took it out of the scarf and this is what it look like um that's my back up these is um, usually I can get like my Herbati and uh, my Gouda here and it is very, it way more less expensive, turn this off now, less expensive um, than what I'm used to getting, getting let's see, y'all remember I did my hair the other day, I can't wait to uh, wash it one more time, it's going to wait a week, uh, so the silver will be even more silvery, okay? And got my specs on today. Let's turn all this off. That is so noisy. Okay, so let me see. Yeah, this is the one that the music is not like ridiculously loud, so I can still uh, talk when I'm in there, not unless they change it since the last time I've been. So let me get you turn this camera around and we can get out of here. Hey guys, it looks like they got baskets today. Remember when I was here about a month ago, they didn't have any baskets, so it looks like they got a few baskets today. Let's see, they got a few. So I don't know if they got some from the other store or what, but I don't have to go scaring nobody trying to get their basket. So let's go in here and see what's going on. Okay, guys, you guys know when I first get here, the first thing I do is stop to see if they got my white chocolate. And they do. I'm just going to grab a couple of those. Maybe three. Wait a minute, what else they got? They got vanilla. That's vanilla, vanilla, and mocha. I like the white chocolate. Those are the ones that's usually hard to find. I do like the vanilla too, but I'm trying to get three white chocolates. I'm gonna grab some salmon over here, like I always do. Let me wait. I'm gonna wait for him to get done. I'm gonna go around him. Okay, guys, he did move out the way, so I'm gonna grab two of these. Um, do they have the? Yep, they got the steel head. I like the steel head, and not the coho, but I wanted the steel head anyway. So I'm gonna grab two of these steel heads. Get a pretty good. Let's see. Guys, they do have the steel head. Look right there. They have a few of those, maybe about six of them. But I wanted the, uh, not the steel head, but the coho. See right there, and there. And then I like to get these little pinwheels, the smoked salmon pinwheels, just to snack on. They are $9, $8.99. I didn't get none today. But the ceviche is $4.99. It's always $4.99. And Dante likes to snack on that. So let me check the dates on here. 1125, 1120. Let's get the 1125. The little ceviche. It's pretty good. And I was gonna get some strawberries, but my strawberries I had just went bad. But I kind of wanted to make something with some strawberries. How much is it? They are $5.99 for the strawberries, I think. No, that's the raspberries. How much are the strawberries? Oh, they're only $2.99, I think. So that's not bad, but am I going to use them? Hmm. Oh, they got cranberries. Look, they got a bag of cranberries if you guys like like the, um, I think they're only $2.99. Like if you guys like to make the fresh cranberry sauce for Thanksgiving. We like the old school. We make everything traditional, but we, for some reason, we grew up on that, uh, you know the the jelly cranberry in the can. <laughs> That's that. No matter what, people make it and it's good, and I like it. But I like that old school 
a little jelly thing. Okay, guys, I do see it now. So the cranberries are three ninety nine, dollars 99 And the, is that blackberries? Oh, blueberries are five ninety nine, dollars And those strawberries I was looking at are four ninety nine. dollars So five bucks. And they got avocados, three for five dollars. And they're the big ones. And I don't think we're out. So I might probably grab a couple of the avocados. Yeah. Look, guys, they got all kind of organizers here. I'm going to grab a couple of these because I have plenty of organizers, but most of mine, like this, do not have tops on there. And I like, you could put them in the refrigerator with the tops on it, and then you could stack them. And they're only, uh, they're by Simple Mate. And they're only uh, $4.99. So I'm going to grab two of these. I probably don't know where to put them, but I'll figure out something. But they got all kind of organizers and jars and stuff here. Okay, guys, I finally made it over here to the cheese. But before I show you that, I want to show you um, what I got. I got some of the party wings. Uh, this pack, eight seventy-eight. A little bit high, but everywhere else is a lot more. But let me show you what I'm kind of stoked about. I got this whole pack of um, breast for eight eighteen, and the this pack of breast at the regular store. I think it's about 16 17 dollars and then i just got some drums uh i like to make my chicken uh chicken not, what's it called my chicken dumplings with the drums i boil those off but I, i'm kind of stoked about that so let's see what kind of cheeses they have i like to get my her body fit here and i don't see it see people are kind of hip to that now a lot of people are coming here to get their cheese. Oh, you know what? I gotta get some gorgonzola because I like to put the gorgonzola crumbles in my um, in my salad, and that is $3.99 for that gorgonzola. And then maybe grab some parmesan for when I make my um, Alfredo sauce. $5.99 for the big one. I don't want the big one because I'm just just make a little bit. But that big thing is $5.99. Usually at the regular grocery store, it's $5.99 for the regular size one, but let's get the macaroni and cheese. Let me grab one of these. Oh, I like white cheeses. Goodness. Is this the white one back here? No, it's yellow. But I'm gonna grab this one because I can make a some kind of tray with that. And then they got the feta crumbles for $1.99. I might grab one of those. And then they got the Colby Jack. Let me grab this. For my tray, I can make that. And that's only $1.99 for that one. So I'm gonna grab that and grab this extra sharp cheddar. And that'll be good for a tray or something. Uh, oh my, her body is not here. I wonder, I did not wanna pay full price for that. Oh, I gotta grab some of this. I like when I use the pasta, the linguine or the fettuccine, I like the fresh, uh, what's the butoni? Butoni, whatever. I always, we get the fresh. I like it better than the dried, but I will eat the dried, but I'm going to grab two of those because here, look at that, $149. They're a little bit more at the regular store. Oh, Parmesan. No, that's Romano. Okay, so they got her body slices for $2.99. Okay. And they do have some sharp, but I like, I like the extra sharp when I make up my macaroni and cheese. It's also the orange, yellow cheese. Like I said, I like all white cheese when I make my macaroni and cheese. A lot of people I know they like to see their macaroni and cheese orange. It doesn't bother me. I don't mind it being white. As long as it tastes good. Okay guys, let me show you what I found. I did find the Hervati and they are it's $4.99. And this is this is good. And when I can't find that one, it was that Castello, which is really good. I'll get this one. So I'll grab one of these. I'll probably put this on my tray. Um, but for the mac and cheese, and, and this 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 is good, but this has a better flavor, the Costello. I got that one, and then I did find some Parmesan, which is $4.99. I can grate up myself for my Alfredo sauce. I'm gonna grab that, and then let me see. Let me grab all this and put it in this cart so I don't get it mixed up. Let's see. And um mozzarella 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 i did find some fresh mozzarella 
So here's some mozzarella. I like that in Mike Mac too. I'm gonna grab that one. And that one is $5.99. And they got a Roth, but it has jalapenos in it. So I do not want the one with the jalapeno in it. So I am going to grab this truly grass fed. I have no idea what that one tastes like, but I'm going to try it so I can get out of here. Um, did not find the Monterey Jack, but you know what? Even though I didn't find the Monterey Jack, they do have Colby Jack, so I think I will grab um, a Colby Jack. That'll be fine. I can use that in the place of Colby Jack. Um, I'll use half of that. And this is, uh, what, what is the price of this? It went up a little bit. It is $7.49. used to be $5.99, so it went up quite a bit. So I'm going to grab that, and then I'm going to get down here and see if they got some butter. You know, butter is out of hand right now. What is their butter here? Oh my gosh, even the butter is expensive. Usually butter here is like $2.99. Butter here is $4.69 now. I'm gonna grab two of these. Um, I get the salted butter, uh, unless I just absolutely have to get the non-salted. So I'm gonna grab two of these because I'm getting low on butter. What's the natural? It's the same thing. I'm gonna grab two of these. Make sure it is salted. Salted and that's uns unsalted over there. So I'm gonna grab the salted and I need cream cheese. They have Philadelphia uh, 259 for the Philadelphia cream cheese and 249. So it's not that much of a difference. Usually Oh, wait a minute, they got some kind of style blend, which I don't know what style blend means. Some kind of, it's $1.99. I'm not gonna chance it. You never chance stuff on the holidays. So I'm gonna grab a couple of these because I think I'm gonna make a cheesecake. So I'm gonna grab a couple of the, uh, cream cheese is cream cheese, as long as it's full fat. I'm gonna grab a couple of those. And oh, look, they got the pizza dough right there. And then I like to get these, um, these biscuits. They're quick and the five is perfect. So you don't have leftover biscuits and i think i got everything because i got cream at the house um yogurt 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 okay nope because they're about to close so i'm just trying to get a few things really really quick okay y'all i'm back y'all this little girl in here then brought me out of my character okay so that's why i didn't bring y'all back up so here, let me turn this down i am hot as fish grease okay so remember I told you guys I was grabbing my few little things because they were about to close. So they kept announcing, um, okay, we're going to be closing in 30 minutes. Okay. So I mean, I hear you. Okay. So then they announced we're going to be closing in 15 minutes. So then I grabbed a few little things. That's when I was showing you guys the cheese and everything. So I grabbed the, my cheese and stuff and headed up. And so then it was five minutes left before they were closing. Okay. And so this little girl, she going to come and say, Oh, I could take you on um, phone number two. And I said, oh, okay, no problem. And I go, I said, oh, let me grab me some um, some Red Bulls. My husband like likes the sugar-free Red Bulls, which I know he ain't supposed to drink them. I don't want to hear that in the comments, okay? But um, I grabbed a couple uh, Red Bulls. I like uh, the watermelon one. You guys got to try it. It's fabulous. But anyway, so I, I grabbed my stuff and everything, and they were ringing up people. And she's just standing there, like, tapping her feet, okay? I'm like, whatever. And so then after I grabbed my my Red Bulls, it, then they announced, I don't need this, they announced um, that they were they were closing. They were closed, you know, whatever. So um, she said, you want you want boxes or do you want, um, what did she say? Do you want boxes or you want bags? You know, I said, well, it doesn't matter. She said, well, the boxes are free. I said, well, put in the boxes. That's fine because they charge for bags up here now. Girl or y'all, let me tell you. As I'm putting my stuff, she's ringing me up, ringing me up, ringing me up. And there's other people in line on the other thing, right? Whatever, you know, some people got a few items. Um, some people, you know, some people got just as much as me or whatever. But I'm in her line. I'm the only one in her line because there's only two other people, two or three other people there. So she's going to say, uh, ma'am, miss, we, we we would like you not to. No, she goes, no. First she goes, oh, where you been today? And she said, well, you been at work all day? I said, uh, no. And she goes, oh, what you, what you been doing today? And I'm looking at her. I said, no, I have not been at work. You know, she goes, oh, okay. Well, we ask that uh, when you, when you come shopping, if you come shopping, you not have this much groceries at the end of the night. Res you know, you respect our time. I said, excuse me? Because I wanted her to repeat it. <laughs> <laughs> to make sure that I heard it correctly. She said, we asked for you not to have 
this now mind you i didn't have a lot of stuff i had the stuff you guys i had a few other things you know whatever i mean it was 260 something dollars but y'all know that don't buy nothing right now okay because everything is double what it what it usually is right and i bought some some high price items or whatever and and she goes yeah she said um i said aren't you you're just now closing right and she was like yes i said okay and she said but um yeah when you, when, you know you come at the end of the night but we act just just you know not have a big order i said you done lost your damn mind i said did you really just say that to me i said little girl don't don't have me go off in this store i said ring up my ring up my items and she said well i, was, I said no you don't act, it ain't none of your business what i've been doing all day it ain't none of your business if i just got off of work i said I came in here, I come in here all the time. I come shopping in here all the time. And yes, you guys are about to close. I came in here 45 minutes before you were about to close, okay? And I said, as much as I come up in here and I've been robbed outside of this place before and I still come here? Oh, well, that's not our business and that's not our problem if you've been robbed here. I said, I had the woosa, okay? I had a really woo saw. So I said, little girl, <laughs> ring up my items. Okay. And I was, I was getting myself together and I said, oh no, no, no. I said, I always let stuff go. I always let stuff, stuff go. I had just talked to uh, the manager because the manager, when I was out looking at the cheese, he was in the back too. And he, he was, we were talking about, um, the chicken and stuff I was buying because he was the one showing me like oh look 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 this was uh, you know whatever because we were back there talking because he always sees me in it because he had apologized when I got robbed before here and he was like I was so upset I remember when it happened and because we I was we were looking for him and they came out and looked he was helping me look and they were trying to give me all my groceries for free and all that and I was like no 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 and they were like oh do you want a voucher whatever I was you know I should have took it now now I should have took it I didn't take it I was like no I'm just pissed at my car you know that, that all that stuff happened here whatever so I, I didn't take it or whatever but he he remembers me because you know I, I didn't blame them because you know it was just people hanging around here or whatever but I said I walked over to him because he he was in the front of the store because people were walking out you know how they 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 locked the one side of the door and um that you know he had locked the one side of the door and then you know people were walking out or whatever I said uh let me tell you what your little cashier just did and I told him the story and he was standing there. He was like, I'm so sorry. And I said, who does that? And who says that to a customer? He goes, kids. He said, kids that don't know no better. I said, yeah, kids that ain't got no home training. I said, I don't know what y'all got to do. You, you, you need to get her some training. Okay. Cause I, I'm actually being nice. Okay. Somebody else would have went off more than I did. Okay. And so then I went back over there and she was still ringing me up and I said, um, and then she had walked around to, cause the other cashiers was like, they was like, doo -doo 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 -doo. like they didn't want no parts of it. Right. So she walks her butt around. Okay. In the midst of me telling the manager to talk to the other cashiers. All right. So I walked back over there. I said, uh, you need to ring me up. So, so I don't, so I'm not wasting any more of your time. And she was like, well, the machine is just waiting for you. I said, you need to get back over there and package up my stuff and ring me up since you in a, such a rush to get back, get home. And she was like, oh, I, okay. Well, um, I, I didn't mean, I, I'm sorry. I, I no, she goes, I didn't mean to offend you. I said, well, you offended me. She goes, well, I can tell. I said, yeah, you did offend me. I said, you don't say that to no customers. I said, I, said, I don't know where you from, what kind of jobs you had before. You don't say that to no customers, okay? Because I did not stay and shop when, when, when you guys closed, okay? I stayed and shopped until you guys closed and then was right here at this cash register. So regardless you got to ring up they still ringing up people i'm le i'm leaving right now they just got done ringing up everybody so yeah i'm y'all can tell i'm hot as fish grease okay i was about to run to the bank and, and that, i ain't even doing that i'm taking my butt home okay <laughs> that that little girl that little girl got me so heated okay but <laughs> you guys that is my look at my hair i look a mess uh, look look i look a mess y'all know i told you i'll never wear my hair because because i don't I, I hate the way it looks you know but i was just running to the store but um you guys like comment share and subscribe for this story i need a thumbs up <laughs> you guys have a great day <laughs> bye <laughs>